we didn't have all the answers during this flood. And so it really forced us to get out there and talk to different people and new organizations to really figure out what the barriers were to rebuilding. What was the next three months, six months, nine months going to bring? And how do we use Dow's size and resources to help with that? You know, when that weekend of August 12th came, um, we noticed that this was not going to be a normal event. And we received many calls, but one of the first calls we received with an offer of funding to help us do the work that we were doing was from uh, Stacy Gotro with Dow. And there were issues out there that, that weren't necessarily in Dow's wheelhouse, such as mental health. But that didn't mean we couldn't partner with people in our community to figure this out. I serve here as a school-based therapist and I carry a caseload with students here at the school. And what Dow did was provide grant money to allow me to get this program started here so that I could work with the kids. We have kids that I'm working with who lost their homes during the flood. We have kids that have lost photographs of members of their family who are deceased. We have kids who have lost things that were meaningful to them and valuable to them. And what I brought in is some stability for these kids. And we're seeing a lot of change and success in a lot of these kids. They're learning ways to feel better about themselves and their situation and looking forward. The barrier that we had with our kids was, it was a mental barrier. And some of our students, because they were able to see Ms. Verdell, they, those barriers, those walls, they came down. One thing that we're grateful for is the fact that we have industry-based support. They're able to make investments in things that, that are very focused and, and that will truly make a difference and have an impact. Um, here we are, it's one year after the flood. The needs are not gone. The need for support is always going to be there. I'm glad to see that the focus is still with the future. It's true we've made a lot of progress the last year and there's still a lot of work to be done. But Dow's going to continue to have this conversation and we will keep working with the people in our community to do more.